Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Football Manager 2019. Continue our uh, playthrough as Salford City. Uh, here's the results of the last couple of games that you guys missed, the two away games. Uh, we did win against Gateshead, and we lost against Sutton. Both of them pretty close games, though. And at the end of the day, I, I would have been happy if both of these had been draws, uh, which would have only gotten us two points. So even though it kind of hurts a little bit more, a win and a loss actually gets us three points, which is better. But somehow I still, <laughs> I feel like I might have been happy with two draws in a weird sort of way because just a loss just in general just doesn't feel good at all. But anyway, we're in a better position overall, so I think that's going to be okay. Uh, in fact, if we look at our the, the, the table here, we are, you know, pretty solidly in sixth place here. You know, there's, there's, it's still early in the game or early in the season, so a lot of these points are pretty close. But I feel like we're uh, we're doing a pretty good job overall. So next game is against FC Halifax, which is... Down here, second from the bottom. So here's hoping we can get a little bit of gold diff against them and get a get a solid win uh, here at home. Go ahead and hit the next, get things going. It's only a couple days of rest before the next game, so hopefully our guys can can take advantage of that and get some get some uh, good recovery here. Uh, Gaffney putting on another pretty good show overall. Got another goal for us. Uh, Torre, actually, who was the better player in the previous game, ended up doing not so great to that game. Still looking to get a couple more players to kind of rotate in, especially if we're going to continue to play a very high, aggressive, you know, attacking mentality. 800 season tickets this season. It's not too bad, I suppose. I think they only expected us to get like 700 or something like that. Training schedule. Looks like we have these next two games, and then we have a pretty good break here for the game after that. So hopefully we can get a lot of good rest in there as well. Focusing a lot on defending in the next couple of days. Um, most vulnerable to facing a 5-3-2 wing back. I don't think that's going to be anything we're going to be playing anyway. Uh, people are not happy with training at the moment. Okay. More quickness training. Add get stuck in, huh? Well, that's probably going to get us a lot of yellow cards, but we'll we'll see what we can do with that. Uh, once more strength training. Actually, I think we can do that. Development training. Additional focus on strength. Looking pretty good. He's actually been doing some pretty good training lately, so that's good to see. Um, Danny Lloyd. Attacking midfielder center. Yeah, no, that's fair. Roy Gaffney. Attacking midfielder wide target man. What? Why would we be training G Gaffney as anything other than... Yeah, we're not going to be playing training him as a wide target man. That's not going to happen. Defensive midfielder. Uh, You know what? A defensive midfielder could be useful. Currently a weakness. Okay, I'm okay with that. Attacking movement, I'm okay with that. In individual training, no longer a weakness. So strength and defensive positioning sounds good. And sure, I'll go for that. I think I like most of those, except for Gaffney being a wide target man, which not, we're not going to be playing that, I don't think, this season. Uh, we're touted as favorites. Good to see. Especially playing in front of our home fans. I mean, we should be. I mean, they're 21st in the, in the league right now, so we should definitely do a, have a pretty solid game against them. 20-year-old center back. Extremely interested. Pretty good jumping reach, actually. Central defender. I mean, I'd like, still would like to get some better defenders. Attributes. Okay, we just looked at that. Position and role. Medical. I mean, we still don't know a lot about him. But he's 20 years old, so he's possibly got some, some room to grow. We're really just not seeing a lot of lot of uh, feedback about him, though. We may need to scout him a little bit more. Although he's got possibly up to three and a half stars potential. You know what, we're going to keep scouting him for now. It's going to cost us some money, but we have a little bit of money in our budget for that reason. Nugent here. Mm, fairly basic fullback. 
But we do want another fullback. He does match our signing philosophy of going for uh, younger guys. Still got some doubts. We're going to keep scouting him for now. If we can get these guys on a relatively on the cheap, I suppose, then they'll have a grand scheme of things. That would be really good for us. Uh, fullback here. They're saying he is a would be a good signing. He's currently one and a half stars, possibly even as high as three stars. Could be as high as five stars. Hmm. You know what? I think we will actually. I mean, if they're, they're saying he might be a pretty good signing. I mean, a lot of these stats don't look good, but I mean, jumping reach pace, that looks pretty good. We're going to trust our coaches here, even though we don't know much. I mean, at worst, he's two and a half stars, which honestly would be a good thing to have for our left spot because we have some weakness there. So you know what? We're going to go ahead and approach to sign you, buddy. Hot prospect, full time, contract length. You know what? I'm okay with a shorter contract just in case you don't work out. Um, I'm going to drop that down a little bit. Drop that down a little bit. I'm going to give you a pretty basic contract. Terms are acceptable. Finalized deal. I like it. Good stuff. 19 years old. Got a lot of, lot of work ahead of him, but uh, I think he's good, going to be a good guy overall. Um... It's a str uh, striker. Could be useful. Again, if it's our philosophy. I mean, he's not going to be expensive, so that's part of the reason why I'm okay with doing some of these. I'll use a little bit. Hmm. Twenty one thousand, really. You no, know, fine. We'll give you the request of salary, but we're gonna lower these a little bit. Not much, but just something. Okay, cool. I think that's gonna be okay. I mean, he's not asking for a ton of money, but whatever stuff that we can um, adjust as much as possible is good for us. I mean, we're still pretty well below our payroll level we have zero dollars in the transfer budget as of right now but if we ever need to we can put some more back in there i think i don't know i think i'm okay with that if we can groom him up to be a pretty good decent player even if we don't ultimately end up using him maybe we can trade him off or something who knows sell him off i guess specifically all right mark shelton has finally passed his fitness test that's good it'd be good to get shelton back in the rotation they're woeful. We're playing pretty strong. How are the rest on the guys? Um, Pond here is looking pretty tired. We'll bring in Hogan for you. Although Hogan's not playing that well. Uh, cool here. What can we place for you with? Swap around Mafuda, And we'll bring somebody else in place here. Actually, what I'll probably do is bring Maynard across. And we're actually going to start good old Walker. I mean, I could start Shelton and just swap him out early. But no, I think we're going to start Walker. Again, I know it's crazy, but I feel like he's just going to be good for us in the long run. Playing 7.28 average rating. Uh, this is, everybody else looks okay. Pond is a little tired. So anybody else we can bring in for Pond? Bring in Jones to swap in at some point. Cool is pretty tired. So it's going to bring in... Actually, we're going to bring in Shelton. Oh, no, his, his conditions are actually pretty bad. Never mind. Uh, we do need, a, like, a midfielder or something, I guess. I guess is what Whitehead can play. And the rest of these guys are okay. Bring Collins in at some point. But no, I think this is going to be okay. This looks all right. Get a pretty good rotation. Everybody else is, you know, getting a little tired, especially Wiseman back here. But I think overall we're going to be all right. Facing off against a 4 2 3 1 wide. Do this for the fans. 
Go out there and give the fans something to cheer for. Really, Danny? Calmly. There's no pressure on you tonight, buddy. All right, still stress. Whatever, buddy. Sorry. Didn't mean to stress you out by telling you that the fans were looking forward to watching you play. All right, Lloyd's going to kick it up to Rooney. He's going to uh, possibly get... I was going to say, he's probably going to get over here to Wiseman. He's going to get up to the side. He's going to cross it in. Oh, it's going to get deflected, though. Rooney's going to get back, collect it back again. Probably going to kick it up. Nope, he's going to get back, which ultimately will get up to Walker. Up oh, Mafuda. Going on the defense now. Close, low. Oh, good tackle. I was going to say, I was kind of scared for a second. I thought, they're not going to call that, are they? That was a really good tackle. Overall, we're pretty tired, but we're, we're less fatigued than the other team. So, over, I feel like our, our stamina is going to be able to keep up with us. With this attacking mentality. Drop down to 7th position. We haven't even done anything in this game. Alright. Free kick here. Goalkeeper comes up and catches the ball cleanly. Kick it off. Rooney's going to head it up to... Okay, nobody. But it's going to get collected back in again. Manny's going to be able to get it up to Walker. He's going to come up the side. No, he's going to kick it over to Toure. Who is going to come up the side. Get it back into Walker. He's going to... Pretty good kick, actually. Had a very good chance of going in. It's a good job, Walker, there. Thank you for putting some pressure on them. Got to throw in for the other guys. He's going to kick it back. Hogan's going to collect it. Torrey's going to get it up to Maynard. Maynard's going to get it all the way up to Gaffney. I thought he was, but he did not quite get it. Was not able to connect. And then we're back on the defense again. Uh-oh, Southwell. Okay, we got, got in the way of that one. But then they collected it again. He's going to kick it back across. Hogan's going to kick it back to the goalkeeper. He's going to kick it up deep. Are we going to be able to collect this one? Maynard's going to get it over to Walker. Walker's going to get it up to nobody. Come on, Walker, buddy. Let's go. I have faith in you, man. Lloyd's going to get it. He's going to go. He's going to cross over to the side. And not get a good open shot. Kicks it wide. Up. Oh. Got in the way of that one. Rooney's going to be able to get a pretty good tackle there. Up to Lloyd. Up to Gaffney. Thought he had a good shot there. I thought that was actually a certain goal. Did not go in. Do have a corner kick out of that, though. Lloyd's going to kick it in. Up to Gaffney. He's going to get over to Wiseman. Had a pretty good shot, but there was a deflection in the way. And McLeod's going to kick it back to Hogan. Nope. And that's it for that highlight. Uh-oh. Lloyd has, a, has an injury. No, buddy. Are you going to be able to get back in there? I think he's going to be okay. I think he's going to be okay. Just walk it off, buddy. Walk it off. Kick it up to, oh, there we go, Peregrini. Got in the way. Wiseman. He's going to be able to kick it up to Maynard. Up to Lloyd. Does get it. He doesn't look too injured, thankfully. Wiseman's going to get over to Maynard again. Back up to Wiseman. Inside to Walker. Walker's going to, uh, what's going to do with it? He's going to get it over to Lloyd. Lloyd's going to get it over to Gaffney. Good shot, but just the, the goalie was able to get his hand in the way. Do you have a corner coming out of this? Lloyd's going to kick it in. And another corner coming out of this one. Come on, Lloyd. Get it in a good spot, buddy. Lloyd's going to get it in. Gaffney's going to be able to get a little bit of a head on it. Not too much, but they were able to defend that pretty well. Uh-oh. They're going on the offense here. Uh, free kick given. Southwell's tripped. Apparently, Hogan's about to get himself a yellow card, most likely. Yep, there it is. Yellow card right there. First yellow card of the season. And they are going to get a free kick out of this. Good good job getting our hand in the way, goalie. Lloyd has a groin, but should be able to... I uh, suffered a groin pull, but should be able to play it out, they said. Rooney's going to get it back over to Wiseman. Wiseman's going to back into Rooney. Back to Wiseman. Back to... Nope. Over to Mafuda. Mafuda, sorry. Over to Walker. It's going to get it up to Lloyd. Lloyd's going to get it stolen, but he's going to recollect it again. He's going to kick it into Walker. Back to Lloyd. Back over to Maynard, who finally gets it into the goal. I mean, we had a lot of, lot of stuff going on in front of that goal right that time. 
were able to finally get it in. Second goal of the season for Lois Maynard. Good to see. I'm going to skip that one. I think that one was well played out, though. Moves us up to fifth position. Yeah, Walker got his first yellow card of the season. Wow. We are playing with the get stuck in mentality, so to be fair. So we're probably going to get a decent number of yellow cards. Uh, Gaffney's going to be able to collect it. Is he going to be able to do anything with it? He's going to kick it over to Maynard. Maynard's going to have a pretty wide open shot. He's going to get a second goal of this. Oh, he should have. Should have had that one. Had the goalkeeper coming out. But it was just enough pressure to, for him to kick it wide. We have 11 shots so far to there too. Seven on target. But only one goal. Our goalkeeper has been pretty solid. Wiseman's going to throw it in to nobody. Mafuda's going to be able to pick that up though. Walker's going to get it over to Maynard. Back to Walker. Back to Maynard. Over to Wiseman. He's going to kick it over to Rooney who's going to get a good wide open shot. That was a really, really well done. I saw that coming in. Oh, it's good stuff, Rooney. It's actually your first goal of the season. I'm I'm, I'm surprised, I should say. Actually moves us up to third position now. Two goal lead. Going to throw it into Rooney. Uh, Wiseman's going to be able to get that back. He's going to be able to get it over to Lloyd. He's going to get up to Walker. He's going to get over to nobody. I think he was trying for a shot, but that did get deflected out. And that is a throw in for, for us. Walker's going to throw it into... Well, it's going to get deflected back to Ture. Walker's going to get it over to uh, Gaffney here. Gaffney up to Mafuta. Mafuta, I should say. And it is a corner for us. Lloyd's going to be able to kick it into... Is Rooney's going to get over there? Nope, Rooney was not able to get over there. And uh, Halifax is able to pick up the ball. Lloyd is still wanting to come off. I'm really hoping he can make it to halftime. He's playing really, really well. He's got an assist already. I know he's hurting, but I, I'm just trying to get him to halftime. Yes, I get it. I get it. We're almost halftime, buddy. Three minutes, man. Three minutes. Go ahead and tell you to ease off tackles, Hogan. We don't want to get a red card here. Wiseman gets a yellow card. Throw it in to McLeod. He's going to get it back. Oh, actually, quick, or Duckworth, I should say. Oh, Torrey was able to pick that one up. Gaffney's going to be able to collect that one. Get it over to Lloyd. Get it up to Rooney. Rooney's going to be one-on-one -on -one with the goalie. And the goalie's going to be able to catch that very easily. Rooney was not able to do quite enough with that to, uh, to get it in. We are going to get a whole throw in for Halifax. Although Torrey was going to be able to intercept that. He's going to get over to Maynard. He's going to keep it himself for a little bit. Rooney's going to be able to get a shot. Pretty good shot. Again, the goalkeeper, though, staying home. Getting collecting on that. 17 shots, 10 on target, only two goals. We definitely appreciate their efforts. The team is doing a really good job. Keep it up, guys. And we will be swapping out Lloyd here momentarily. He's playing an exceptionally good game, though. Next, I'm going to see how much he's rested during halftime, so he was able to get any rest at all. McLeod's going to be able to, or he's going to get up to McLeod, I should say. He's going to cross it over to Duckworth. Duckworth is going to get a good shot, but our goalkeeper was able to push it out away from the net. And uh, it's going to be a corner kick for Halifax. Kick it in. Hogan's got, uh, got something on it. Going to kick back in. Lloyd's going to be able to get his head on it. Of course, Halifax has still got a little bit of control here. Duckworth going to be able to Burnett. Or Barrett, I think it was. And it's going to be out of bounds. Another throw in. Still a highlight, though. So something else going on here. Duckworth over to McLeod. Is he going to be able to do a shot here? Nope. Blocked a shot, but that will be another corner. A lot of action right now. Halifax with the corner. Mafuda was able to get his head on it. It's going to get it up to Gaffney, who should be able to push this up pretty far. Going to get it over to Rooney. He's got a good amount of space. Going to be able to cross it back in. No, he's going to get deflected. He's going to be throwing for us. There's Wiseman throwing it into Maynard. Maynard's going to get it back to Wiseman. Back over to Maynard. Back to Rooney. Back to Mafuda, who got a good shot, but it was deflected, or maybe it was missed. I can't. It was pretty fast, actually. Pretty powerful shot. 
Uh, how are we looking? Uh, Lloyd, you're actually up to 72%, so you're actually doing okay. That rest during halftime does seem like it did you a lot of good. You're actually our best player of the match so far, 8.6, with a good assist. So I'd like to leave you in as long as possible. Man, another yellow card for us. 4-2 to two on the yellow cards. Lloyd got a yellow card. Everybody's getting a yellow card. All right, we are going to make a sub. Uh, I think we are going to go ahead and sub out Lloyd. I mean, he's got a yellow card, and uh, he's pretty low on the, the fatigue chart, so I think it's going to be a good one. We're going to bring in Whitehead for this one. I think that's going to be a good swap. Halifax kicked it in. Neil was able to collect that one pretty well, though. Neil with a kickoff. He's going to get it up. Uh, Whitehead's going to be able to collect that one. Some fresh legs here. He's going to be able to get it up to be able to get a position to cross it in. Now he's going to get it back over to Wiseman. Uh, kind of a half shot at it, supposedly. Uh, we do want to get you to ease off tackles. It was a corner kick first, though. Walker's going to be able to kick this in. Going to get it into Gaffney, who does get the head on it and gets the goal. His fifth goal of the season. Gaffney doing an exceptionally good job for us. Takes us up to 3-0. Another throw in for Wiseman. Uh, not a very good play. They were able to get the ball back. South was going to have some good chance here to get a good shot off. Uh, off the crossbar. Should have been a goal. All right, let's go and do another sub here. Uh, Wiseman's pretty tired, and he's got a yellow card. Go ahead and swap you out. We'll probably move Hogan over there. I think that's okay. And swap, uh, put James Jones in there in the middle. I think that actually will work out pretty well. Gets us some fresh legs here in the middle, and I think that's going to be fine. All right, another throw in. Gaffney's going to get it into Hogan. Going to kick it up to nobody, and Halifax... Oh, I thought they are going to get control. They are, maybe. Mafuda is going to be able to pick that one up. Over to Torre. Inside to Walker. He's going to push it up a little bit. Going to kick it back out to Torre. He's going to kick a pretty big kick over to Rooney, across the other side of the field. Rooney's going to get back to Hogan. Mafuda over to Maynard. He's going to take a shot. Walker's going to take a shot. Could have gone in. Was able to get deflected, and Halifax is actually making a push now. It's going to get up to Southwell. Offsides. Perfect. Well done, guys. All right. One last sub of the day. A lot of people are getting pretty tired. I think we need to swap out one of the remaining guys as a yellow card. Again, I don't want to pick up any more yellow cards if we can help it. So, um, we're going to bring in... We're bringing Hodden. I think that's going to be good. Technically attacking midfielder, but he'll be all right. Uh, yeah, Walker, go ahead and ease off tackles. Only a couple minutes left in the game. Should be a solid win for us. If we can keep the zero in the in the goal slot for, for Halifax. That'll make me pretty happy. Hey, giving up consolation goals at the end here. Walker's going to be able to kick it in. Had a pretty good chance of getting another goal there, but not to be... That's pretty much time. Are we going to get a kickoff here? That's the end of the game. Good job, boys. 3-0. Really good job. We knew we were going to come in, and we had a pretty good idea we were going to win this one. And uh, we did come through with it. So I'm very happy without that. I'm very happy with the way you guys played. Everybody's looking delighted. Looking extremely happy. Good, good stuff. That does put us at fifth place, though, still. Everybody else around us is still winning as well. Um... But, you know, the more we play, the, the further, you know, a distance we're going to have between, you know, us and the rest of the field. So, as of right now, we're still in the playoff contention. Again, still very early in the season. Um, but I think we're looking pretty strong. Let's see here. The next game you guys will see will actually be the very next game against Chesterfield, who was seventh place. So, they're actually effectively tied with us, although we got a lot, slightly better goal diff. So, it should be a good game for us. I do appreciate you watching, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye.